in store for tonight's performance? Um, well, I have my little dance crew along with me, uh, which is always nice to have on stage. Because yeah. I, you, it just honestly it just feel a little bit different out on stage without the other boys there. So, I mean, I can see Niall in the distance now, and I tell I you, he's on, on at the right moment. Now. I'm missing it. It's comforting having the dance on, and I like it. into the dancing a bit. It takes your mind off things. It's nice. Yeah. You mentioned Niall. He's on stage right now. How has it been reuniting with him on the Jingle Ball Fantastic. tour? Fantastic. I mean, we played a bit of PlayStation yesterday in my hotel room in San Jose. Um, I got a lot of complaints over my feet on the bed. I'm sorry about that. Um, it just that just happened. Um, and then um, yeah, it's been fantastic. He came and hung out for a little bit, but it's just so nice to see him. And I mean, I don't know when you see someone that you haven't seen for ages and you become the same person you were when you were with. I don't know. It's very interesting. Any chance of you guys collaborating on stage at all? I mean, I get up and sing a bit of slow hands. Slow hands. Your fans were also asking me all day. When are we gonna get a Christmas song from you or a holiday well, song? I mean, someone showed me like an NSYNC song that they did the, they did the other week, and I was like, I'd love to do a Christmas song, but I don't want to ruin any of the old okay, classics. Enough. You, you know cannot I mean? ruin a song. It just gets a bit a touch. I love NSYNC now. I'm an NSYNC fan, but it gets yeah. a touch cheesy. Whereas I want to do some. I'd like to do an honest Christmas song, maybe. Okay, that's fair. Put your own little twist on it. Exactly. It's your first holiday season as a father. Any new traditions that you're looking forward to starting? Um, well, I used to go to Disneyland when I was a kid a lot uh, with my, my parents. We used to go to Florida every year, and I like the idea of taking him when he's maybe about six. Okay. That's a way off yet, but that's like my dream. I love that. What are you guys doing for this holiday season, you and the family? Um, well, I have a little nephew that's just been born as well, who's younger than Bear, uh, little baby Ashton. Uh, and uh, so it's going to be very baby full house. So I imagine the happiness and love around is going to be amazing. So. Plans for a full album in 2018. A full album. I am working. I, I kind of changed my mind on a few things. So I'm still kind of working towards it. But um, I don't know. It's different these days. Things aren't very conventional. You can kind of release music whenever you want. So I'm kind of abusing that fact a little bit and trying to find the best songs possible. So. Okay, if you were to release, what would you want to have it sound like? Would it kind of be what you're going with, that like sultry soulful, R&B? Soulful, yeah. soulful fun, soulful pop, you know, enjoyable. Like, and, and, you know, maybe a little bit of hip hop in there as well. Before I let you go, can you pick a question out of our Santa snapback? Who do you plan to kiss under the mistletoe this season? That's a good one. Uh, I'm going to have to say my missus and my little boy as well, bless him. <laughs>